really is a major influence on musical culture in America and, and also in, in the world, um, this hip culture that came from jazz musicians and the black culture and modified through other kinds of, of uh, takes too in the music, the creation of a hip language, and uh, which is ongoing still. And uh, it's, it's a real important part of any of this music that we go in. And it's also my culture. I, I came up in Palo Alto. I had a beatnik teacher in junior high for two years, for two periods a day. That was an influence. And, uh, and Palo Alto actually had a real beatnik scene. So I was able to be a fly on a very hip wall and, and see some very cool stuff. I was part of that folk music audience in the early 60s, so I saw stuff that I shouldn't, I'm too young to have seen, really, but I was, I was there because <laughs> I could. Uh, the Tangent, St. Michael's Alley, uh, Kepler's Bookstore, all these things that loom large in the Grateful Dead legends are my stamping ground as a kid.